All right, Tobias, this is um, a little video of me going over your um, your kit. Uh, so uh, here it is. It's uh, your Voodoo Apothecary kit, and it's um... <clears throat> all right. Let's see here. So this is a Brown Widow Spider, um, and then this uh, these are Coyote Toe Bones. This is a white-lined sphinx caterpillar. Um, this right here is um, tarantula exoskeleton legs. Um, this is a baby octopus tentacle. Um, this right here is a cat bone. Um, this is a scorpion. And this right here, these are... Um, Moral, dried morel mushrooms and um, these are various tools a little mini dagger um, this right here is a um, monarch butterfly um, okay and here in the bottom so this is like an old kind of like a plate you pull it out this way you know so when you, if you see that hook you, you can if you had two hands like I don't you can pull that out and use it and you have this old antique spoon so if you want to take you know something like this this is like purple sand or right here this is a you know red glass you know, if you just want to take those things and, and then put them in here like you're making a potion, um, that's what that's for. Okay. Um, now, this is a um, coyote skull, a really, really old one. It's a baby coyote. Alright. Now, make sure these are real animal parts. So, I mean, I'm assuming you're wearing gloves. But if you're not wearing gloves, please uh, wash your hands or use, ha you know, use hand sanitizer um, before you eat or touch your eyes. That's a crow's foot. Now, crows, um, at least in, in California, are illegal to sell but legal to own. So just, you know, know that this was a gift. And this is a crocodile hand. Also, I'm not selling you this. I'm gifting it to you. Um, this is a macaw um, feather. And uh, all my feathers are naturally molted. Um, this is, like I mentioned before, this is some uh, treated. So it's not sharp, but it's, it's red glass with uh, silver sparkles in it. Um, this is purple sand. This is actually an antique glass but um, I wanted you to have it um, this is you know a magnifier but it's from an old video camera and this right here the, the, this is full of tiny little flower petals and oh yeah this I really wanted to show you so this is a crystal ball so you can see into the future or whatever but um, it comes out like that and I'll pull this out So, you know, it's a crystal ball with a stand where you can take it and, you know, whatever you want to do with it in your uh, role-playing game. I don't know how these games work, but... So, in order to put this back, make sure you lay the plate over the pins, okay? Lay the plate over the pins, then put the... thing back in. It's really hard to do with one hand. So I'll just pretend I did that. Now this is blood, but it's actually fake blood. It's candy blood I bought from Hot Topic many a moon ago. It's probably still edible, but um, I wouldn't recommend eating it. Um, and it's actually in a plastic container. And these are really cool. So this right here, I'll open this up for you. Actually, I need this little plate. So these, this is hematite. Um, 
don't have my tight, but I figured you can take this and with the right tool, you can engrave symbols into it and then paint into this, into the engraving gold. So you'll have your own runes. So, um, I really wanted to do that for you, but you know, I'm doing this for free and I don't have a lot of time on my hands. So, um, you know, you can easily do that with the Dremel and the right tip or, um, you know, kind of engraving tools. Engraving tools are very, very inexpensive. Now, um, inside of this little sack here are just, um, random little, um, polished spoons that you can use for various reasons. Okay. So, you've got all of that. Yep, that's everything, and this was actually meant to, you know, sit a certain way, so just make sure that the latch is what's pointed up when it hangs on your body. Um, I'm assuming you're going to create a strap for it, so it'll hang like a, kind of like a bag. And um, so all you need to do is add a strap to it, add a latch to it, which would be very easy to do with... Um, you know, you just take, you just, you know, we just take a piece of leather, screw it into here, and then you can latch it onto there and put like a little something into the hole. And then for this part, I'm assuming this is going to be what's resting on your body. So take some leather and take some padding and make a little pad for you, for yourself. Um, and, you know, you can decorate this any way you want. You can beat it up to make it feel more authentic, whatever you want to do. It's nice, solid, hard wood, and um, that's it. So if you have any questions, I'll also be taking some cool pictures for myself. So, yeah, I'll take some pictures and I'll label them for you to help you out. Okay.